how do professionals get better at what they do? How do they get great? And there are two views about this. One is the traditional view, that is that you go to school, you study, you practice, you learn, you graduate, and then you go out into the world and you make your way on your own. That's how doctors learn. That's how、uh, lawyers do. Scientists. Now, the contrasting view comes out of sports, and they say you are never done. Everybody needs a coach. The greatest in the world needs a coach. So I tried to think about this as a surgeon. Pay someone to come into my operating room, observe me, and critique me. It seems absurd. Expertise means not needing to be coached. So then, which view is right? Turns out there are numerous problems in making it on your own. You don't recognize the issues that are standing in your way, or if you do, you don't necessarily know how to fix them. And the result is that somewhere along the way, you stop improving. And I thought about that, and I realized that was exactly what had happened to me as a surgeon. So I asked a former professor of mine who had retired.、Um, his name is Bob Osteen, and he agreed to come to my operating room and observe me. The case. I remember that first case. It went beautifully. I didn't think there would be anything much he'd have to say when we were done. Instead, he had a whole page of dense with notes. <laughs> Just small things, he said. Did you notice that the light had swung out of the wound during the case? Another thing I noticed, he said, your elbow goes up in the air every once in a while. That means you're not in full control. It was a whole other level of awareness. He was describing what great coaches do, and what they do is they are your external eyes and ears, providing a more accurate picture of your reality. They're recognizing the fundamentals, they're breaking your actions down, and then helping you build them back up again. After two months of coaching, I felt myself getting better again, and after a year, I saw my complications drop down even further. It was painful. I didn't like being observed, <laughs> and at times I didn't want to have to work on things. I also felt there were periods where I would get worse before I got better. But it made me realize that the coaches were onto something profoundly important. I think it's not just how good you are now. I think it's how good you're gonna be that really matters.